Hey everyone, okay this video is going to be um, <clears throat> pretty much just what I buy at the grocery store. I just went grocery shopping and because um, I'm vegan, I'm just going to show you what I eat. So I went to Trader Joe's and Whole Foods, so I'm just going to get started. I picked up this rice and vegetable um, Benito box and it's from Trader Joe's. It just has like a bunch of veggies with like miso and soy and then um, some rice on the bottom. This was like five bucks. I'm gonna eat this now. All you do is microwave it and it's really good. Um, I love like Thai, Asian, and Indian food very much so like anything like very ethnic I'm kind of like that. I picked up this pasta. This is called Penny Arbara Arborata. I, don't, I can't. I'm horrible at pronunciation. Um, it's just like a quick seven minute meal. It's just uh, marinara, uh, spicy marinara sauce and, and pasta. And then I got these cool little vegetable curry like dishes. This one is vegetable pangang curry. It has carrots, cauliflower, and baby corn in it. And this one has cauliflower, baby corn, and bamboo shoots. And they're just like a spicy little dish. You warm them up and eat them over rice or whatever. Then I got vegetable tempura. Uh, with brown rice sushi, which I don't normally eat sushi from there, but I thought I'd try it. Then I got this Middle Eastern, um, it's my favorite thing. It's only $1.99 at Trader Joe's, and it is um, chickpeas, black beans, what else is in there? Uh, tomatoes, and it's like kind of like um, parsley, what else does it have in there? Olive oil, lemon, sea salt, dried mint, garlic, and that's it. So it's really like a good little salad snack. Then I picked up this Thai vegetable um, cow soy soup and it just looks like this and um, you just kind of warm it up in the microwave and then put the crispy noodles on top. So I just thought that would be like kind of something yummy to try. Then I got these vegetable gonza things. They're like um, a veggie Thai kind of dumpling thing. but. Um, they just have like cabbage, onion, soy, carrots, just like that kind of stuff. And you just eat them like a pot sticker, sticker thing, I guess. And then I got these falafel chips, which um, I've never tried them, but I am obsessed with falafel. And the guy there said they are so amazing, so I definitely picked those up. I got some banana chips. These are for my husband, because I don't really like banana chips, but he like loves them, so I got those for him. And then I got some sea, uh, sea salt and lime chips. These are this stuff is from Whole Foods now um, because it's hard to find any. I love lime and sea salt, but it's hard to find anything that's like Tostito brand and stuff. They all use milk, so it's like I don't know. Then I got some just regular popcorn because I like salted popcorn when I'm like watching TV and stuff sometimes and as a snack. And this is just organic popcorn and sunflower oil and salt. So. Then I got these snap pea crisps, which I love. They're another really good snack. Um, I got Mary Gone crackers. These are just like wheat free, gluten free. Um, they're just like crunchy herb crackers. They're just like another good snack. A lot of snacks. That's what I do is I snack a lot. Then I got this from their deli section. This is um, curry tofu and um, sesame tofu. And if you have a Whole Foods by you, I'm telling you, this sesame tofu is so amazing. It's like the best ever. I already ate two chunks of it. It's so good. It's my favorite treat. I've never tried the curry one, but I'm sure it's good. Um, then I picked up these funny little... Um, Oops, they're called meatless vegan jerky, which I've never had, so I thought I would try it. I don't know what it's if it's gonna be good or not. Texas barbecue, hot and spicy. My husband's probably gonna think I'm crazy. Um, there's only like a couple bucks, so I figured I could try it. I thought I got other ones, but oh well. Then these are my absolute favorite snack ever. They're Hail Mary. They're macaroons. These are the vanilla ones. They have a chocolate one as well. They're all raw vegan. Um, they're the most amazing snack ever. If you like coconut and vanilla, these things are the bomb. And they melt in your mouth. They're so good. And then I got this just because I wanted to try it. It's called That's It. Um, bar and it's just like a little fruit bar and basically it says all it is is one apple and one pear in this fruit bar that's it no sugar nothing else so I just wanted to try it because you know I'm, I'm a sucker for trying things and then oh I thought I had another one and then I got some of these noodles 
These are Japanese undone noodles, or however you say it. I remember my pronunciation sucks. Um, these aren't and not actually for me. These are for my friend, but these are really good noodles anyway. I'm not sure that these ones are vegan because they have that lactic acid in it, and I know that's not technically milk, but I don't like anything that says lactic because it's a derivative of it. So I don't even like to mess around with that, but these are for my friends. So that's everything I got. Um, I'm going to eat the Benito box now, or however you say it. So um, yeah, I thought I'd just kind of show you what I get when I go shopping um, at like uh, Trader Joe's and Whole Foods. So if you have any other questions about being vegan or like vegan meals and stuff i eat a lot of pasta which is probably you know not very good but um beans and salads and i love sushi veggie sushi i eat a lot of so yeah that's about it so i hope you guys enjoyed this video we're in a different location or my kitchen so yeah kind of random but okay well i'll talk to you guys soon bye